That is the song that closes out the mighty fine new album from Gabe Dixon. It's called Last Train Home on Acoustic Alternatives. He's got Susan Tedeschi on a guest on this new release. Apparently, he's also playing keyboards in the Tedeschi Trucks Band these days. A Gabe Dixon cover before that from the uber-talented Jacob Moon on a day just like today was the track. Jacob deserves your support. He just launched a Patreon page. You should look at that when you get a chance. The alternate roots have many great songs over the years, but still remain largely unknown, which is very sad. The first of their songs that became a favorite of mine is one of theirs called Ordinary. This week, I found an old radio station performance from 2014 of that track. Beautiful sister harmonies from the staves this week on the song In the Long Run, recorded back in 2013. Alpha Rev had a couple of minor radio hits, though they should have been bigger in my opinion. I included one of those, New Morning, on the program this week. I was digging through old playlists to find gems like that that I haven't played in a while, and the one from A Silent Film jumped out at me. I remember thinking that song in its fully produced form had hit written all over it. I was wrong, but I still think that melody and story are really good. Danny, Dakota, and the Wishing Well is the title of that one from A Silent Film. Here's a song that might jar you a little lyrically. It'll make you think, anyway. This is Alex Deason, former lead singer of a band called The Damn Wells, and a song called... A little less like hell on acoustic alternatives. 